is, is very simple. Mm -hmm. What I was saying is, you know, all these places, they were named, they have a reason. The names have got a reason behind. Mm -hmm. For example, um, places like Moremi, mm -hmm. there were people who were living there, Delta people who were living there, mm -hmm. and their chief was Chief Moremi. And after those people were moved further to form the Mau village or town, that when that place was called Moremi. Ah. At the moment, even if you go to Mau, the chief now is the grandson of the great Moremi, is chief Moremi. Ah. So that when he's come to Savuti, I mean, all these places, like I said, those with X, Tugana, Takanaka, Tukudum, all those two, 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 mm. those are the Bushmen dialects. Like some of them, we knew what does it mean, and some we don't. Mm. But when it comes to Savuti, like I said, we have got two kind of Savuti, like the Savuti with E at last, and the Savuti with I at last. And a lot of people thought maybe it's a, it's a wrong spelling or it's a spelling mistake. No, both words are right. It's only that the Savut with E is the land. When you talk about the Savut land, you put E. And when you talk about the channel, you say, you put I. You say Savut with I. Because there were people living in the Savut land long time back before even tourism was introduced. Mm. And you know, we all know that you can't live without water. Mm. Then suddenly the Savuti channel started to dry up for many, for some years, flowing back again, dry up, flowing back. Mm. By so doing, they say, mm -mm, this channel is Savuti. So the Savuti with R means the channel. Yeah. And it was named after the problem of flowing, dry, flowing, mm. dry. So that means um, unpredictable or unreliable. Because, you know, they were relying much on the channel to drink water or yeah, to yeah. do. So that when, when the channel flowing, dry, flowing, uh, someone says, mm -mm, mm -mm. we have to move back. Yeah. This channel is now Savuti. Is, we can't rely on it. It's unreliable. Mm. Then they mm. moved it completely, and then the, the channel was called Savuti Channel. Savuti Channel, unpredictable. Actually. Unpredictable or unreliable, kind of, yeah. And Savuti land or Savuti area, Savuti, what does it mean? Savuti with E, e? it means the land. Ah, it means the, the land. land. Ah, okay. And the Savuti with I, it means, it means the channel, the channel. drying up. Yeah. of the channel or unreliable of the channel or unpredictable you can't tell whether it will flow like now yeah. is dry yeah. but it has been flowing for four years from 2010 to 2014 flowing yeah. now is gone yeah. before that it had been flowing for like 28 years no it had been dry for like 28 20, years, years from 1982 to 2010 yeah. no water yeah. then 2010 the water comes, comes back, back again. Mm. But when we talk about that, there's nothing to deal with the rain. Mm. No, it's... Ah, it doesn't have to mm -mm. deal with rain. Because though. this channel, this Savuti channel, mm. this is the same water that you saw in Chobe Game Lodge or in Chobe River. Aha. The river is flowing west yeah. and reach the other river at west, 40 kilometers west of Savuti. And that is called... Uh, Linyanti River. Linyanti River. And then from Linyanti River, there is a Slinda Spillway that connects both the Linyanti River and the Okabango Delta. Mm -hmm. And those are the two places that I said that are perennial wetland. So, and then from there, we have got a little channel that is flowing back east, mm -hmm. and that's what we call Savuti Channel. Ah. The course is in between the Savuti Channel and the Linyanti River. Mm -hmm. There is a lot of tremors. Mm. that are happening in between. Mm. Depending if it's down webbing, the channel will keep flowing. Mm. If it's up webbing, if the plates shift up, then Aha. the channel will die. That's the cause. This is the cause. Cause okay. of the flowing and the drying mm. up mm. of our Savuti channel. Eh? Mm. Okay. Okay, That's wonderful. Thank Thanks you. so much. Mm.